All right, Coach, uh, tough loss tonight. Uh, what are your initial comments from tonight's game? Well, yeah, I mean, it, it, was a, it wasn't a good one. Uh, I think uh, one of our players said it best is, hey, we know some, we're going to be able to see some things that we need to work on. And that's all you can do. I mean, you go, these guys have worked hard in the preseason and uh, they, they've gotten steadily better. Okay, that was a very good Hillcrest team. They, uh, McFadden's a great athlete. He, he made us pay a couple of times when we didn't execute our assignments. And uh, I think that's where we're at right now. We're, we've got a, you know, it's assignments on defense and it's tackling. On offense, you know, we've got to learn our assignments. We've got a couple of great athletes that can really turn a game around once they uh, get into the flow of it. And, you know, the speed of the game for us, I, I think this team is as fast as anybody we see. Hillcrest can be as fast as any team we see all year. And it was good for them to, you know, get that, that speed of the game under their belt. And the best improvement you make is from game one to game two. And I think that'll be our case. I think we'll make a lot of improvement from game one to game two. And in that second quarter, um, the score line kind of got extended a little bit. Can you speak it, a little bit about what happened in that second quarter? Yeah, I mean, we, you know, we had a great pick six by Travazay Austin. We got a safety, uh, but, you know, offensively, we had a couple of miscues, uh, a couple of snap mishaps. Those things happened in the first game, and, and Hillcrest was able to capitalize on it. But, uh, again, that's that's what we've got to eliminate. We've got to eliminate little mistakes. I mean, I can look back at, at four plays on defense. Well, one was the kickoff return, missed tackles. But you look at three plays on um, on uh, defense where they scored three times and, and two of them were missed assignments and one of them was missed tackles. And, we, and those are things we've got to correct and get better at. And um, offense, can you talk a little bit about that? What happened there? Uh, what are some of the miscues you think you guys well, can correct? Uh, you know, we've got a couple of sophomores up front. They're still learning. They're going to get better each and every game. Uh, you know, I'm proud of how they battle. Uh, Miles Ray is a senior. He's a leader. He's on that offensive line. He, he's going to help solidify that offensive line. These guys are physical. And, uh, you know, it's just, you know, you make one little mistake there and somebody's running for free. So we've got to eliminate that. And, um, uh, you know, we've got some good receivers. Uh, that you get the ball to, and they'll, and I think they'll progress even more through the season. I'm excited about where offense can be. Uh, again, we just have to to keep improving on the assignment aspect of it. And uh, what are some of the highlights you saw from today's game that you can kind of take with you guys start the rest of the season? Well, yeah, I mean, there, there's some there's some great highlights. I mean, like I said, I mentioned the pick six. I, we had a couple of good uh, returns in the return game. Um, we had a great punt. I think our punter is going to be in good, you know, good. Um, we, we had snaps uh, all night long that were pretty good. Uh, kicking game, or the kicker did a good job. The, uh, you know, on offense, we made several good catches. Uh, uh, we had a couple of good runs uh, by Deshaun Webb and Denari Lee Jackson. And uh, Nick Fowler ran it up in there pretty good a few times, scrambled for some yards at times. I think we just got to put more and more plays back to back instead of having a really good play and then do, you know, doing something like missing an assignment and throwing us for a loss or, or a penalty or those kind of things. We got to eliminate that. We got to eliminate mistakes and just put a couple of those really good plays that they had tonight back to back. And I think that will help us. And um, this is, uh, I heard the fifth time in the row that Lawrence has lost the Hillcrest. Uh, you guys, Lost them last season, week uh, week zero. How yeah. does this result compared to last year's one? Or, or have you seen a um, regression or progression from last year's team to this year's team against the same opponent? Well, you know, last year's team was a totally different team, really. I mean, we've got um, I think we've got three guys back on offense. We've got a few more back on defense this year. But, I mean, it's a totally different team uh, than last year. Next year's team will be different. I mean, I don't put much into those types of streaks because you know it's not the NFL these guys are here for a couple of years and and they go so um, you know progression of this team started when you know at the beginning of this year okay and I think last year's team progressed from we lost a couple early to we won you know three out of four down the stretch and won the region they progressed they got better now this team is totally different. A lot of different people on there, new chemistry, new gel, new, new group, and I love these guys too. 
and I think these guys will improve as the year goes on, and I think you're going to see a lot of good things from them, you know. And next week you got your big rivalry game against Clinton. Mm -hmm. um, what are you looking, you know, into that with this game, and what are some things you're looking to take from this game into that one? Well, big thing is we watch film on, you know, Monday, you try to correct some mistakes, and then we'll move on to Clinton uh, Monday, and, um, you know, they've got a great team. They've got a lot of team speed. Uh, good system on offense uh, you know they they've done a good job over there so uh, you know out of this game we're just going we're going to move on from this game correct a couple of things and then you know I don't think we'll have to worry about them being excited about playing that game next week and um, and that kind of thing but you know we'll just do the best we can against them just like we would anybody else yes sir